All right, welcome back. So Springfield Armory yesterday quietly dropped their entire line of XDM 10 millimeter handguns. Now these are the, all the full size handguns. They include the XDM four and a half inch handgun, the XDM four and a half inch OSP threaded handgun. Check that one out. I did a lengthy review of that, of Chook's uh, pistol, and I'll leave a card link there in the video. And then also the 5.25 inch competition series handgun. Now notably this does not include the XDM Elite 3.8 inch OSP that Springfield just released. Um, I think that one's doing really well. Kind of curious as to why they did this. I've got kind of two theories. Uh, number one would be, and this is the one I'm leaning towards, that they're going to actually release uh, a new line of XDM Elite 10 millimeters for January SHOT Show or even earlier. Um, I did notice when I did the review of the full size versus the new Elite Compact, the, the trigger pull was at least a pound different. And uh, the OSP 3.8 inch has that meta trigger, which is just phenomenal. It's a great trigger. So I wouldn't be at all surprised if Springfield revamps um, and releases XDM Elites. The other theory kind of floating around, and I saw this on Reddit, is that possibly the full size line wasn't doing as well as Springfield Armory wanted it to. Um, and so they just, they just dropped it and went with the uh, XDM Elite 3.8 inch at this time. Uh, you know, after having reviewed the full size XDM, it's an impressive pistol. I highly doubt that with the way and the popularity of 10 millimeter right now, that Springfield would drop all of the full size 10 millimeters that they just released. Uh, especially since basically the 3.8 inch is exact same frame size, just cut down to accommodate that 3.8 inch barrel. So it's kind of funny though, um, when manufacturers do this, they don't make announcements, it just kind of drops. And on the website, there's actually, it takes quite a bit of hunting around, but there's a discontinued area where you can kind of go through and still look at the specs and the old information that they have left. It just says discontinued. So I'll roll some of that footage uh, while I'm doing this video. Anyway, let me know what you think. Do you think this is something that just 10 millimeters popularity is kind of peaked and it's on the on the downslope now and so Springfield seeing that seeing the writing on the wall and deciding to drop the whole line and just go with the compact version or do you think this is something that they're going to revamp and re-release with an elite series of full-size 10 millimeters put the meta trigger in it and have that that good four and a half inch four and three quarter inch a really crisp, nice trigger, and uh, and some of the other accoutrements. So, anyway, as always, please like, share, comment, and subscribe. Check out my Patreon if you get the chance. It helps with ammo costs and, and uh, gas. Thanks for joining me on the journey. LW Road, out.